ATVM hose down station is a high temperature and high pressure wash down device that may cause serious injury if used improperly. Installation and commission should only be done by qualified personnel. In this video, we will review operation of the unit, safety startup procedure, setting the temperature, and shutdown of the unit. Wear protective clothing. Heavy duty insulated gloves, boots, aprons, and face protection are recommended. Do not point the spray nozzle at your body or anyone else, and always hold with protective gloves. Press the water handle downward to initiate the water flow. Press the steam handle downward to initiate steam flow. The hose down station features interlocking handles to prevent steam flow from being initiated alone. Do not tamper with or otherwise alter these handles. Serious injury could occur. Before pulling the trigger, hold the spray nozzle firmly in both hands and adopt a body position that will prevent loss of balance due to recoil. Before you turn on the hose down station, a safety check by qualified personnel should be carried out each time it is used. Due to the presence of steam, ensure that due care and attention are observed. Turn off the cold water with the globe valve on the hose down station, allowing only steam to enter the mixing valve. There should be no flow observed at the nozzle after a few seconds for remaining hot water to evacuate from the hose. If steam is detected during the test, the unit must be taken out of service immediately. If the unit passes this safety check, it is ready for normal operation. After verifying proper over temperature shutdown, the unit can be adjusted to the desired operating temperature. To do so, turn both globe valve handles fully clockwise to close both sides. Pull the steam and water handles downwards. Pull the trigger on the nozzle and start to turn the water globe valve counterclockwise until the desired flow is reached. Slowly turn the steam globe valve counterclockwise until the desired temperature is reached or is fully opened. To increase the temperature, slowly turn the water globe valve clockwise until the desired temperature is reached. To decrease the temperature, slowly turn the steam globe valve clockwise until the desired temperature is reached. To shut down the hose down station, the following procedure should be used. First, while pulling the nozzle trigger, push the steam handle upward, leaving only the water handle down. Then allow the hose down station to run only water for a short period of time to cool the unit, approximately 30 seconds. Push the water handle upwards to shut the water off until flow stops. Release the nozzle trigger and return it to its proper place. Never leave the hose down station unattended with the interlocking handles in the open position. After viewing this video, you should remember these key safety points. Never point nozzle at your body or anyone else. Never leave the hose down station unattended without releasing pressure. Never use mechanical means to hold the trigger in open position. Always adopt a proper body stance to anticipate high recoil force before pulling the trigger. Exercise care and caution. Avoid body contact with non-insulated parts of the nozzle while spraying. Wear protective clothing, including heavy-duty insulated gloves, boots, aprons, and face protection. With these tips, you should be fully prepared to operate your STVM hose down station safely and effectively. If you have any more questions or would like to learn more, please contact our engineers at 1-877 379-8258 valves at thermomegatech.com or visit our website at www.thermomegatech.com